Hello. What's up, everyone? We're going to go back to yet another reaction today. We're hopping into the originals episode number nine, season number one, called Raining Pain in New Orleans. Hopefully, it's a great episode. Hopefully, it's a lot of fun. Hopefully, you've been enjoying the series. If you have, like, comment, subscribe to the channel, Patreon for the full reaction. I'll get episodes over if you want them. If you don't, totally cool. Episodes will be here on YouTube whenever they show up. So, previous episode, we had... All right, so the previous episode, the main thing that happened was, of course, at the end, Klaus feels like his family has betrayed him and he just can't trust them. So he's taking Haley and they're leaving, right? That was like the main thing, right? Because essentially, you know, Rebecca teaming up with, um, um, with uh, Marcel. Elijah kind of going to the woods with Haley. And he's having some trust issues right now. So we'll see how he handles things. You know, we still have the witch stuff. With um, Davina, I think her name is. We haven't seen the one girl in a while, the one that was connected to us and now is not. Not sure how she's gonna play into anything. We haven't seen her in a bit though. Uh, Tyler's knocked out somewhere. Our plan didn't work. Marcel picked up the coin. Yeah, the whole plan that we had was kind of trash, honestly. I feel like if we were gonna do that, you know, do it right. Got a shitty plan. But it backfired. So we're gonna hop in here. Have a good time. Here we go. Just dinner with him, Haley. Let us begin oh, never mind. with a toast. But as vampires, we feel more deeply than humans could possibly imagine. Yeah, see, this is why he essentially we're gonna eat the servers, aren't we? Insatiable need. Exquisite pain. See how that's relevant. Why are we he's losing our ship? Punishing us. Oh, he's... well, we've heard him. Plus, is taking our Deeply, ship. It would appear. We believe the worst about him. The one time. Me, and that. Uh, are you taking this down? To be clear, if the court. Oh yeah, she right figured now, out something too, right? She saw that the picture. Like Cammy, what are you doing here? My question exactly. Oh, it's quite all right. She knows. And for the record, the level of awkwardness we're all currently <laughs> experiencing is entirely genuine. <laughs> you think you're so clever, don't you? Compelling the poor, naive bartender. Look what I found. Real me, not your compelled therapist. Mm -hmm. Won't leave here, do you understand? Yeah, showing him the paper was a mistake. I think that just about does it for the day. You may go. And as some jacked up peace offering to Marcel's crew. You have to help them. And the bayou. Do we look like a bloody vampire rescue squad? <laughs> I think you should be grateful we came to save you. Listen, Rebecca, all my life I've wanted to know who my real family was and... Bag inside pocket. Well, the picture's gone. Because you showed it to him. Oh, wait, never mind. You have a recorder. And so then I bit Elijah and left him in the bayou with my hybrid venom in his vein. Serves him right for making such vile accusations again. We won't have a problem. Wow. More importantly, Dude, does he not know what. Does he not know how this works? The locals. Don't bring any unwanted attention to the city. Now, history has proven that. You know the factions considered your terms. We the decision. Have you? Oh! They decided. What the fuck? They decided not to do it. No. You know? This meeting. The hell we did. Actually, I called it. Uh, we're dead. Klaus, I had nothing to do with it. I made a grave error during our earlier conference. My friend Marcel offered me wise counsel and I wait after you. We should probably say that hey, the priest stays alive. No. Oh man, we just murdered him all. There he is. A lone survivor. Such a sad day for our city. Some of its best and brightest killed. Then we reopen negotiations. They're dumb as fuck. They were like, you know what? Let's just shoot these guys. Send them a message. Like, if they're not going to retaliate. 
You said. You can go now. Damn, pissed off, bro. <laughs> He's I'm like, not making myself clear here. This is a threat. <laughs> He's a... Precisely three minutes, tiny little. I recommend you heed my warning. It's two of us. Like 15 of you, Max. What's the kind what was the reason? Like she was like, oh, you, you want them alive. Well, I thought the situation demanded something a little dramatic. Who is that? As long as I'm in the family way, well, you can't do a damn thing about it. She has a lot of power if she really thinks about it. I would befriend the shit out of her. My violin. They must left in the attic. Heard of? But I wouldn't lie to you to get what I want. I'd ask you. I guess that's the difference between. I don't get it. How come the one woman isn't stuck in that wolf form then? Is she not like legitimately directly connected? He, he found that he came. He went and got the violin for you. Looking for something? Okay. But do you know I am weak as fuck? Where else are you gonna go? Well, she's weak as all hell. Why the hell would he? I mean, he's weak as hell. He can't do nothing. My sub is everywhere. Of the bulk. Serves you right. Just ordered. So naturally, I questioned him. He spoke of a legend, a legend wherein long ago, a chief of theirs had fathered a child to a very powerful witch. In mythology, further oh, states this your dad. Child, the son was later transformed into something this clan had never before seen. Damn, they're getting rid of Cammy. Fuck. Oh, Cammy was gonna be a bigger part. Oh, it's quite alright. She knows. She does. Fit your vampires? Don't worry, he's compelled me to forget everything as soon as I leave. You are tenacious. Now, boy! Now! Wait, what? Me. Oh, shit. Wait. How did she do that? An original by my side. That's not something I can just turn my back on. A power. Not even for you. Damn. A power. When you were reliving history with my brother, did you happen to revisit what came next in 1919? Or have you forgotten our little secret? I know the words that will make him hate you forever. What's that? Remember that when you're embracing your new family. What are the words? This is gonna hurt. I'd be like, Oh, man, that was like a horror scream, bro. Shit. Okay, that was episode number nine. All right, so as soon as she came, she's not going anywhere. I thought she was going to leave, but so she just, Davina just helped, made her remember everything. So now she knows everything. This stuff about her brother, Marcel, Laos, every compulsion. Fuck. Okay. Uh, so Marcel, it's interesting to see Marcel's character right now because he essentially had this whole big plan to go against Klaus, right? And he had failed, obviously. But now it's like Klaus has this power. And Marcel's like, wait, I got this powerful ass witch. I got I got an original. I've got this. Even though you could I mean, I guess you have the original. I guess you could have essentially Rebecca as an original. Also someone stronger. On your side, and Marcel sees this power. Sure, he'll be second in command, but he has this giant power that he 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 desires right that's an interesting route to go with him i did not see it going that way i don't know why i guess i didn't expect that i shouldn't have expected that we also had uh what else did we have we had that we had the cami stuff elijah is clearly in love with Haley. we'll see where this goes he forgave klaus because we saw we, we actually saw in the past what happened like how elijah didn't help klaus when he needed to and he should have against their father we have the connections now to the fact that 
Klaus's uh, families out there. I would have been kind of worried. Wait, that means that the one woman knew that this new these new werewolves coming in were related to Klaus somehow. That's interesting. That she would know that. Interesting. So Haley's family's out there. We haven't even seen them. So Haley's family is just always werewolves. I didn't. I don't know if I. I don't know why I didn't catch that. They're always werewolves until there's like a full moon, and then on a full moon they're human for one day. I don't know. If, I never caught that for some reason. Uh, but yeah, overall I thought the episode was really good. I like the characters in the show. I think that this is doing a better job right now in the first. You know, obviously, it's the first season, so you're getting to know everything with the characters and everything than Vampire Diaries is right now. But I just think it's a story that is more compelling right now. You know, Vampire Diaries is like in its fourth or fifth season. This is in its first. So it makes sense. But the way that, you know, Rebecca and Elijah are helping Haley against Klaus, even though Klaus is doing it all to save Haley, it's this interesting slippery slope, right, where I don't know where it goes. Like, in the end here, Elijah, uh, Klaus said, you know, you and Elijah and Rebecca are welcomed back because they're family, and it's our home. So they could literally just come back if they want to. Next episode. I thought the cop stuff, as cool as it was, was the, uh, the dumbest shit ever by the cops. Like, they they have to know what, they, what he is and what Marcel is, right? Like, Marcel himself could have taken out these people. These humans thought they had way more power than they actually did. And it's like, what? How can you think that? So this guy, I don't I don't know what's going to happen to him, but he's probably going to die. He's like her best friend. Also, she went to Cami. We had that one night with Cami, I guess. So I guess her going to Cami is the only human person she knows and she makes her remember. So we'll s- but I feel like Mar- would Marcel and them check Cami's place? How's she going to get help from Cami? Like, where's that going to go? Oh, yeah, this is the whole... Oh, this is when they were taking out the werewolves. This is when they took out the council. Um, Marcel, essentially, the loyalty. I like that Haley was like, so what happens when I have the baby? Like, what do you do with me? And Claus doesn't answer. Which is kind of like this scary-ass thing for her because, like, what does happen to her? It's like, she's going to be the mom, mom of your child. Like, what does Klaus care? Um, what else we got? Cammy thing. I, I thought this was interesting because Klaus clearly cares about Cammy, right? And even um, Marcel says earlier in the episode, he was like, "Oh, well, yeah." When they're cutting her, but he's like, "Oh, you don't care about much, so it's kind of so I can tell when you do." But he cares about Cammy, and now Cammy's not going to leave. But if Cammy doesn't leave, then Klaus is going to be like, "Wait, I compelled you to leave, and you didn't leave. Something's going on here. Something's going to signs up." And that'll lead to something. I thought they were going to kiss. I thought finally they would kiss. Um, but yeah, overall, rock solid good episode. I just, I'm very curious what's going to go. Because now Davine is with Cammy. They're going to try to hide it with that one vampire guy. So they got to figure out a plan. But is there a plan to take out Marcel? Is there a plan to have Davina hide somewhere? We haven't seen that Sophie girl in fucking forever. So, and now that the elder is gone... She just could leave. Like, she's like, they don't need, there's nobody looking for her. So, yeah, like, is she going to turn on myself? Like, fully turn on myself? So, I was the one that helped her. It's super interesting. But, yeah, that's the episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm going to get out of here and I'll talk to you guys later.